Hi everyone, hello and welcome to Happy Wednesday Dollar Tree Haul. I am here, we are back, and I hope everybody has had a fantastic couple of days since I saw you last in Happy Monday Dollar Tree Haul. And now I have some amazing things to show you guys. I do wanna point out that I am still on vacation recording this haul for here today, Wednesday. So I hope you guys enjoy the little bit of a background that I could put together for today in the hotel room. I made these two wreaths back here while I've been away and it's been so therapeutic just to have some downtime and to do some crafting away from home. So without holding you guys up, let's get into hauling because I found some pretty spectacular things. So I went and I found some more eyeglass cases. And as you know, I am the girl with 63 pairs of prescription glasses. I get all my glasses from Zenny Optical. They're extremely affordable and they are prescription. So I love to find these eyeglass cases at the Dollar Tree because they are really a great quality eyeglass case. And the designs on them are so adorable. So these have this really nice canvas type of texture to them. They're very, very sturdy and thick, and they have an excellent closure to them. So they snap, they're like a little metal, and as long as you push the two ends together, they will pop open and seal, and inside it is a soft landing. So put your glasses in these, and they are gonna be safe. Throw them in your purse, throw them around, and they're probably going to be scratch-free and perfectly, perfectly fine because my glasses are a lot to keep track of, and they've always done really well in these cases. So I found this style right here. I also found this style, which I absolutely, absolutely love. It says, choose kindness. So I love that that says that in that gold lettering right there. And I love the pink and the gold hearts throughout it. I also found this one that has like that beautiful um, rippled look to it with all of those different pinks, kinds of shade, shades out to like a lighter pink into a purple with all the little speckly gold stars throughout the entire canvas. So I really, really love the look of this one. That one's probably my favorite actually because of the style of it. And then this one as well with the XOXO. And I love to say XOXO, hugs and kisses to everybody all the time and lots of love sent out to you guys. So this one's really pretty and I love the gold striping throughout the light pink. So I picked up all four of these. These were the only four that I found that were different than the ones that I already have. So I grabbed those. Now, I do wanna tell you guys that I picked up more of these um, Very Berry right here. Very Berry is the color that I picked out in this Chapstick brand of lip gloss that I found maybe like four or five hauls ago. And this has total hydration, moisture and tint in the SPF 15. And the Very Berry, you can't tell it's on my lips because it's faded throughout the day. But this is my favorite, favorite color. And I have never tried the chapstick with the lip tint in it. Hands down, probably one of my favorite feels to the chapstick and the tint on it is so incredible. I'll have to take a picture of myself in the light of day and post it to my Instagram so that you can see the very berry shade on me during the day so you can get a clear look of what the color is. And it's just, it's an absolutely gorgeous, gorgeous color. So I picked up three more of these just to have backups because I never want them to run out. Awesome, awesome, awesome. And I was so happy to find those continuously at the Dollar Tree. Now, I also found a couple of really fantastic books and I got these for gifting purposes. Um, these are from the Ever High, Ever After High series right there and this is fairy tale ending a school story these books originally go for $13.99 they are a hardcover book they're so beautiful bright and how cute is that to put together for a, a tween and it's a nice good big thick chapter book 
So I really, really love this. You know I love reading, promote reading all of the time. And to make a little tween basket with these additions in it are such a great steal to pick those up for only a dollar or a dollar twenty-five. Then I picked up this one also so that it, they can go together. And again, this is the Ever After High. This is Once Upon a Pet. And again, another really great hardcover chapter book. And again, this went for $13.99. So I really enjoy that. And if you can go to the store and find the Ever After High dolls and put these together in the basket as well in like the Barbie section at the store, that would pull together like a whole themed little basket for Easter. I really, really love how bright and visual those are. So I was happy to grab those as well. And then I found some Suave Essentials Milk and Honey Moisturizing Hand Soap. And I have never found this at the Dollar Tree as of yet. So it was a perfect new pickup. And you know how much I love my scented soaps and perfumes and room sprays and all the good things that just clean you up and make you feel fresh and good and smell really, really nice. So this is the Milk and Honey and uh, it's a nice big bottle. I actually love how silky the bottle looks. It just looks really, really pretty. And I love the shape of it and the rounded edges. So it's a really attractive bottle. This washes away dirt and germs. It says won't leave hands feeling dry. And it's a 13.5 fluid ounce bottle of hand soap. So this was completely new. And I wanted to snatch that up because I'm quite sure that outside of the Dollar Tree, that goes for more than a dollar. Then this one right here is the Suave Essentials as well. And this is the Peachy Clean. And I love peach. I absolutely love peach. And this is Revitalizing Hand Soap with Vitamin E. And this is, again, a 13.5 fluid ounce um, bottle of hand soap and look at how pretty the packaging is on it this one with the sunflower and the little ray of sunshine coming between the sunflower and the peach I think that that is such a cute picture on the front of this really really cute bottle perfect for like Easter time to put on your sink to wash your hands it's like got that pretty pastel peachy look to it and I really 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 love this for all the reasons so I picked that up as well, and I can never have too much hand soap. We're going to wash our hands for the rest of our lives, so I like to make sure that I am fully stocked up in that stuff. Then you guys know how much I love the seasonal changes when they bring out the animal planters, and they come out with like a set of four every single year. Um, every single season, I mean, that's different. And these are probably one of my favorites that I've ever seen them come out with. I found this animal planter right here in a flamingo and that couldn't be any cuter if it tried. I love flamingos and I love that they name them also. So this one's name is Frasier, Frasier the Flamingo and how cute is that? Hello, my name is Frasier and yes, hi, how are you? And I'm so happy to meet you. This is so, so cute. And then as I've told you before, they have those little faux succulents also in like the crafting section in my particular stores that you can pick up where it's like one pick with a colored succulent. Those are the ones that I usually get and I pop them in the back and kind of just set them out on my counter spaces in the bathroom on the sink or something like that to decorate an area. And I love this pink flamingo so much. But then they have this one, which is a zebra. And I love this zebra. How unique that they just threw in a zebra in there because the other two that I did not get in this brand new lineup is a kitty and a doggy. And even though I loved them and I thought that they were so cute, the doggy was different than my candy girl that I have as a pet. So I didn't really want to get it. And the cat, I don't have any cats, so I didn't get those either. But there is a dog and a cat that's quite cute in this brand new set of all four for the springtime of these animal planters. So you guys can look for those. This one is Xena the Zebra. How cute is she? She is so, so cute. And they actually have a succulent plant 
and the craft section, the faux um, succulents, that looks pretty close to what that looks like with that little peachy look. And I think the peach against the white and the black zebra looks really, really nice. So I love these brand new ones. Oh, here it is right there on the packaging. So this is the other two that they have. They have Kara the cat and they have this doggy right here, Duncan the dog. So those are the other two that they have this time at this particular um, point in the season where they're bringing out the spring stuff. So you know how much I love that. Now, I am going to spin off to show you guys some more stickers like I told you I was going to because I have bought so many stickers. It is not even funny. And a lot of people have asked me about my intention cards. And I literally just kind of came up with it because I love making my vision boards, but then they kind of just hang on the wall and you get used to them being there. So you don't focus in on them all year long. And they kind of just become part of the ambiance that you don't really you know, stand there and read every day. So I thought with those smaller packs of paper that the Crafters Square section offers, it comes in a big, huge bunch of just like scrapbooking, cardstock paper, and, you know, just different shapes and sizes, different shades and colors. And it comes in a package that says 200 grams of crafting paper or something like that in the Crafters Square section. So I bought several different packages that look like they had different color options to them. I picked up some of those and then I went bananas over the stickers and I decided to put my vision board purposed things that I normally would make a huge, huge collage with for the wall to situate every New Year's Eve. I decided to make a smaller version of that in card form and decorate them with my wildness to entice me to carry it around with me in one of my little carrying cases to stack my cards. And when I need them during the day and I want to sift through them and remind myself of what my intentions are all year long, all the goals I want to meet, all the things that I want to achieve, then I can sit and flip through them at any point in time because they'll be with me wherever I am. So I made them on those little cardstock papers and I've just been having a blast making them. So I am going to share some videos with you over on my Crazy Callen Vlogs channel where I'm going through my cards and explaining how I set them up and why I set them up so that you guys will get an idea of maybe, you know, getting your own thoughts together to make your own intention cards. So with that, I picked up so many stickers as you've been seeing, but I have picked up way, way more because they are killing it in the card section in the Dollar Tree right now. This is seven pieces from the Crafters Square brand, and this one is pertaining to friendships. And this says, a good friend knows all about your best stories, but your best friend has lived them. And that's the biggest sticker down here, and the rest go on from there. So where I have so many beautiful new family and friends here on my YouTube channel, I wanted to get stickers that dedicate to you guys for my intention cards to continue to go on with my journey here, meet some more incredible people, and just have fun building these bonds and being a part of this platform that is literally allowing me to have so many benefits emotionally and, you know, just in a happy way it just makes me so happy so i wanted to grab some cards to make some intentions toward my youtube journey and my family and friendships that i have here um one of the other stickers says the only way to have a friend is to be one and so a couple of the stickers there that i read to you but this is a really nice set then we also have this set right here and this one is seven pieces as well from the Crafters Square brand. I absolutely love the teacups with the flowers coming out. This right here says good times. They're all so beautiful in that little teapot right there with the little flower arrangement. I love this set right here. So I picked that one up. Then I also grabbed this one. This is a 10 piece from the Crafters Square brand. I love the one that says thankful because I am every single day. The flower pot that has the little heart on it with the little, um, I don't know if that's peonies, but those pretty little purple flowers. The little flower sun hat. I just love them so much. This one that says faithful. 
So that's this set right here. I also grabbed, I'm going to go through a few, but I won't go through so many that it's like all stickers. This one is an eight piece and I thought this is pretty cool where Father's Day is coming up. This one says world's best dad. He's lifting weights. My hero. I love dad. Um, this one right here says strong, funny daddy. Um, Mr. Fix It legend it has a tie and a trophy. So I thought that that would be really, really nice to kind of make like a scrapbook page just dedicated to my husband. Um, and then I got these that are kind of like mosaic looking and I absolutely love these. There is 19 pieces from the Crafter Square brand. And will you look at how beautiful, beautiful, beautiful the shimmer is in all of these. It looks galactic and just absolutely stunning. I love the pewter look to this one. They're all so beautiful. The tie-dye look. They're absolutely gorgeous. I love this little set right here for just like embellishing the corners and the edges to my intention stickers. So I picked those up right there. Then I also picked up this one that says Grandpa. And there's 11 pieces in here from the Crafter Square brand. So it says Grandpa. It says Time Together. It says Friend, Teacher, Fishing. So this one will be like toward my grandpa and our relationship together when I make a scrapbook page for him. The little hat and his golf bag. So I love that one so much. And then I also grabbed this one that says mom. And I call my mom mom a lot. So I thought that this was really cute with that beautiful little butterfly on there. It says um, greatest mom of all uh, of all the gifts that life has to offer. A loving mom is the greatest of them all on that one right there. So I thought that this was a beautiful little set and also the pastels in it are quite, quite pretty. So I grabbed that and then I'll show you maybe one more and then we'll save another set of the stickers for Saturday's Dollar Tree haul. So I don't wipe you guys out, you know, in attention with just stickers. This is seven pieces from the Crafter Square brand right here. And this one says, you're a star. You're awesome, winner, you rock, well done, you shine, you're braver than you believe, stronger than you seem, um, and smarter than you think. So I loved this one so that I can make an intention card about just being strong and, and about loving yourself and just to make sure that you're reminding yourself of all these things every single day. So I loved this set right here. And I will put that on one of my cards and make a whole theme out of it. So here's that set. And then the rest I will save for you guys at another time. Then I thought I would grab some more stuff for Easter basket making. And they have some brand new little bows and scrunchies that match. And will you look at how cute that is? How sweet would that be to grab two of these, make little pigtails and you know, one of your little girl's hair for Easter Sunday and slam these bows in it. How sweet is that? I love the sparkle around the edges of the flowers. I think that that's really, really a pretty detail. And I love the mesh look to it. Just look like fairy tale looking and it's just really pretty. And it's a barrette so it has like that little slip in factor so that you can put it right into their hair. And then I also grabbed the little scrunchie that matches. So the, the color is really, really pretty. That really light, light pink. So gorgeous. So, and that's a good little stretch to the scrunchie. So I thought that that set would be so cute to grab for Easter Sunday or Easter basket to wear at another time. And then I grabbed the blue option as well. So... The, this is like more of like a periwinkle blue, which is one of my favorite colors. So again, it has that little, that little shimmer around the edges of the flowers. And it's just really such a cute bow. And then the barrette clip on the back. And again, here is the scrunchie. So that is what the scrunchie looks like. 
And I think that those are pretty sweet little sets. So I was happy, happy, happy to find those. Then I found some of these, like, what do they call them? I don't know why I'm drawing a blank, but they are sun catchers. That's what they are. So this is from Creative Hands brand right there. And I found this one that says, thank you, with a beautiful rainbow over it. Has the little paint set right there and the brush. And then the hole in the top so that you can put the string through so that you can dangle it. We always did sun catches when I was little and my Nana's had them all suction cupped to their window so that the light would shine through. And so I have like a sensitive, like emotional connection <laughs> to sun catches because I always did them myself. So I picked up this one that says thank you. I also picked up this one that says good vibes. And that is me because don't mess with me unless you're coming with good vibes because I won't even entertain it. I am too old and I have learned my lessons and I love those good positive vibes. So this one is really groovy looking and cool. It has all of those beautiful flowers all around it. The peace signs. It's a really big piece. And again, the paint and the brush. So how sweet is that? And these would be really cute to add to like a crafting Easter basket if you're going to make a crafting set. And then this one right here that says be kind. And which way am I holding it? Because I'm holding it upside down. So this one right here says be kind with the sunshine and the smiley face and the paint again and the brush and the string so that all of these can be hung up. So I really, really, really was happy to find all of those with these really beautiful messages. Thank you, good, vi um, good vibes, and be kind. And that is totally me. So I was really excited to snatch those up. And I'm probably keeping those because I want to make sun catchers for my windows so that when I open my windows in the springtime and I open my curtains, I can see those beautiful little pieces shining through. So there's that. Then I found this little baby right here, and I thought this was totally cool. This is a change jar, so it has the little slot right there for you to be able to save all of your little pennies and nickels and quarters and dimes and everything else. And this one says, warning. It says, she who, ha <laughs> she who does the laundry keeps the change. So I <laughs> love that so so much i think that that is totally adorable it's shaped like a house i love the background in it it's like a grayish tone with that white little leaf look to it and it's shaped really cute and it's a nice st structure to it i mean this is like a metal and that glass is a really really nice thin like it's just really clear and crisp piece and I think it would look really cute on a countertop or in your laundry room on a little shelf and you know what you should be the one that's collecting the change if you're doing everybody's laundry so I think that that's pretty funny and cute and clever so I grabbed that then I picked these up and I absolutely love these because as you guys know and as I've told you I am doing my bedroom over in like a gardening like springtime theme and then I went and I found these unexpectedly and how beautiful are these shadow boxes it has this gorgeous gold rim frame all the way around it then these little butterflies inside are like I believe like they almost look like window clings and then the saying is on this one it says believe in yourself so that's the butterfly and it says believe in yourself and it's really so so cute so it has this string so that you can hang it up and it can just situate on your wall and I'll kind of just like mingle that right in to the ambiance that I'm creating in my room. I found three of different ones all together. This butterfly is definitely my favorite. I love all the muted pastel colors throughout it and this saying on it is follow your dreams. So I absolutely love the messages and look at how pretty that butterfly is up close and personal. So, so, so cute. And again, on the back, the string to put it on the wall. So there's that one. And then last but not least, here is this one. 
and I love that one that beautiful like teal blue it says enjoy the little things just a friendly reminder to make sure that you're loving and appreciating and being grateful for every single day even if it's a down day it's teaching you something so take it and run with it and again there's that string so I love these so much and I think that they're gonna look so cute with all the greenery that I'm putting into my room and I got brand new green like a sage green like bedspread and pillowcases and I got swags for over the curtains um, that are just like greenery and I think it's gonna pull together really nicely so now I don't have too much more to be quite honest with you because I'm on vacation and I haven't been doing too much other than relaxing sightseeing and I saw my son and my son's girlfriend yesterday and we had like kind of like a day of just spending time together and going out to eat and putting around the little country shops and everything. So I have a few more things for you guys before we wrap up this happy Wednesday Dollar Tree haul. I've been crafting a lot, as I've told you, and I went to the Dollar Tree that is close by where I'm at, and I found some more of the onion grass with the little Easter egg embellishments throughout it. So this is the blue color that I was trying to explain to you guys that they had with all of that really pretty iridescent grassy look to it. So I did pick that one up. I picked up the purple one and I love 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 the purple also I've been making wreaths like crazy while I've been here I've been I'm Easter decorating this whole hotel room I called my son the other day and he saw it in here and he was like mom he's like this almost looks like our house what are you doing here you're like decorating it like you're staying here forever <laughs> so we were laughing then this yellow one right here, I think is just as pretty. So there are, those are. And this one I already hauled for you guys the first time that I was showing you these with the floral stems that I picked up, but I wanted to show you all four of them together. So this is that peachy one with all of the iridescent grassy look to it. So there's all four of the onion grass from that floral section in the Easter area. And I think that they are so, so, so pretty. Now I also found this little thumper bunny and I loved him because he's tie dye and he actually matches the earrings that I just picked up on final clearance at TJ Maxx. And I was really, really excited to find. So I love him. He has every color that I absolutely love. Pastel, his big, little, tiny, cute, big thumper feet. He's just so sweet. He's so, so soft. His eyes are sewn in. So is his nose and his mouth. So there's nothing on here that I would feel is dangerous to give to a child under a certain age. He's just soft and fuzzy and fluffy and he's my friend and I'm keeping him because I just think he's absolutely beautiful and I'm just going to use him as an Easter decoration in my house, but he would be such a beautiful little addition to an Easter basket if you were going to pick it up for that too. So here's his cute little sweet face. And then let's see, because we're almost done, um, I want to show you the scarves last but not least because I was so excited with these scarves. So you know that I wear the scarves mostly in my hair or I'll tie them to like one of my backpacks if I'm going away and I just want a cute little addition to my bag. But mostly I wear them tied up with a big old bow in the top of my hair. And I picked up this one right here. This is the brand. And then these are brand new scarves that I have not seen them come out with yet. So I think that they're brand new for the spring. And I love the fluorescent colors throughout this scarf right here with all of these beautiful, beautiful butterflies throughout it. So I grabbed this, this one right here. I also picked up this one and this is such like my color this sea foam green look and it's kind of wrinkly but it has like that paisley look to it 
and I think it's just it's a beautiful summer color so I snatched this one right up again it is the juncture brand I'm trying to show you where all the wrinkles aren't like completely taking over the look of it so let me just try to stretch it out a little bit more for you I don't know if that helps at all but it's that pattern on it right there so I grabbed that and then last but not least I picked up this one again from this brand and this one is this pretty 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 pastel -y pinks and a little bit of a deeper pink so beautiful so so beautiful for the garden like if you're going to a tea party this reminds me of having like a tea party I love this scarf so much the colors throughout it with that little greenery all through it is so, so gorgeous. So those are the three scarves that I got. And that's it. Happy Wednesday Dollar Tree haul. I hope you guys enjoyed this haul. I hope you had fun being here with me. I am going home from vacation on Friday. And then we will resume normalcy for next week and actually for happy saturday dollar tree haul it will be a normal recording i did the best i could with the lighting today this room itself this is a very very old resort that we're staying at it's like a historical resort and so there's you know it's just an old building because uh, it's a historic site so it's kind of cool and we're way way up in the mountains so the lighting isn't like really extravagant in here um or updated so we pulled over a lamp which i don't know if it helped or not but i hope it helped a little bit and i hope that you guys enjoyed everything that i hauled for you i love you guys so so much i have been posting a lot over on crazy Callen vlogs because i haul for you guys things outside of the dollar tree over on that channel as well as vlog for you guys of the things that I'm doing that I want to share with you. I do a lot of chat with these and I just like spending time with you on more of a personal level over there and just have fun. And um, I love being here with you guys pertaining to all Dollar Tree hauls. This is my Dollar Tree world over here and I just love it and I love all my connections with you guys you guys mean so so much to me and I just couldn't be more grateful so thank you guys we are super super close to 900 and once we hit 900 if we do there will be another giveaway offered to you guys and just thank you thank you for being like the kindest people I have ever come in contact of knowing and being around in a large crowd of just sweet and genuinely nice human beings and that means everything to me because it just fills my soul to know there are so many great people on this earth and I would have never had a chance to know any of you if it wasn't for this platform and I am so thankful that I de decided to jump in and try this out and it just made me so happy. So thank you. But I'm going to let you guys go. I'm going to clean this stuff up. I'm going to go spend some time with my husband. I spent the first couple of days with my mom. Now my husband's here. My son and his girlfriend came yesterday. It's been a family week. And we are just having some nice quiet time in nature. So that's it. I love you guys so much. I will see you in happy Saturday Dollar Tree haul. And I can't wait to come back. So if you wouldn't mind, subscribe, like, share, comment down below and hit the bell notification so that you are aware of every single time that I upload a new video. Saturday's Happy Dollar Tree haul will be back at my house in my location of normal recording. So I will see you guys on Saturday. Until then, stay happy, safe, love, bless, kind to one another. Always be kind to one another and spread that love. I love you guys so much and thank you. And I will see you in a couple days. Bye, everyone.